Hi everyone and welcome to another quick tutorial with me, Michael Turney. Today we're going to have a look at the quickest and easiest way how to animate some typography in Adobe After Effects using no plugins. First we'll go up here and go to Composition, New Composition. Then we'll go HDTV 1080 25 frames a second, so 1920, 1080, square pixels and 25 frames a second. And we'll leave the duration at 5 seconds here. Click OK. We'll then select the type tool. Type our first word here. Select a cool font and if you want it in caps, click this button here. And this is how you select your fonts. To scale it, drag left and right here. We'll leave this around 300. And then copy this by Control and C, Control V, or Command C, Command V. And then we'll pull this down over here. And then we'll do the same again. Copy, paste, move this down here. There we are. First, with number one, we'll select our layer here where it says one and click P. We'll move to around half a second here and we'll hit the keyframe. Move back to zero seconds and drag this off to the left but hold shift so it keeps it aligned here. And now if we hit the space bar, we can see it come in. We can right click, so select the keyframes here, right click, keyframe assistant, ease in. Now this will go faster at the start and then smooth in and slow down here, like that. So we'll select number two and we'll make this a 3D layer by clicking this. If you can't see this option, switch the toggle mode here until it pops up. We'll then hit R for rotation and just see which one it is. There we are. So it's the Y rotation. To undo is Control and Z if you mess something up. We'll keyframe on the Y. Move that to one second, the keyframe. And then while we're at half a second still, we'll pull the Y so we can't see the two around about there. And then we'll also pull the actual layer in itself so it starts from there. So now if we play from the start, one comes in, then two comes in this way, so from a 3D angle. We can do the same again to this, select both the keyframes, right click, keyframe assistant, ease in, or we can use shift and nine as a shortcut. Also to give more motion to it, you can click the motion blur tab here on all three of the layers and turn it on here so it's blue. And you'll be able to see already it has some blur to it, just to make it things smoother. And then here we'll pull down number three, click animate and character offset. And then range selector. And then here we'll click on the add. Uh, properties and scale. Then we'll click add and then properties and position. So we'll now move the position down here by dragging it. And then we'll keyframe the start here, move to around two seconds and drag the start of the range selector up to 100%. And there we are, animates the text up this way. So then we can do the same again to ease these keyframes in. We can select both and use a shortcut that we've learned, which is Shift and F9. So now if we play it by hitting the spacebar. And there we are, the quickest and easiest way how to animate some typography in Adobe After Effects. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And feel free to follow me on Instagram at tierney.tv. Thanks for watching.